Lyon still had a slim chance of clinching European football next season when they hosted Montpellier on Sunday afternoon. Centre-back Castello Lucabar's suspension meant Laurent Blanc reverted to a four-man backline, with Chelsea loney Mo Gusto making his first start since returning from injury. Montpellier, meanwhile, were riding high after a resounding 4-0 victory in Monaco last week, but little could prepare them for what they were about to experience over the next 90 minutes. This was perhaps a must-win for Lyon if they were to keep their European hopes alive, and so often the source of inspiration for his side Alexandre Lacazette again proved to be the man to get them going as he fired home at the far post after Bradley Barkola kept Ryan Shirky's initial cross alive. Great work from Shirky and his captain as obliging as ever in putting the ball in the back of the net. Falling behind seemed to incentivise Montpellier though didn't take them long to get back on level terms. Johan Lepinon was robbed of the ball in a dangerous area by Joris Schotter. He fed Elie Way and the 20-year-old made no mistake in poking home the equaliser. The second goal came almost instantly for the visitors. Nightmare 60 seconds or so for Lepinon. Another mistake was pounced upon by Way, who then jinked into the area and forced home an effort to put his side in front. A deflection, a touch from Anthony Lopez, and then onto the woodwork, but somehow finding its way over the goal line. That was enough to see La Payard into the break with a narrow lead goals for 30 minutes and then three in 11 but that nothing compared to what the second half had in store. Leon looked to get going quickly after the restart but after a scramble in the box came to nothing Montpellier broke at pace and that man again away burst into the box was brought down and the referee would point to the spot. The linesman flagging for offside initially the VAR would see that overturned. Clearly onside as he made the run. So the informed front man dusted himself off and completed his hat-trick from the spot. But he wasn't done yet. Just like in the first half, barely a minute later, he would strike again. Latching onto Shotar's lofted through ball, lifting it beyond Lopez and keeping his head to incredibly fire home his and his sight fourth of the afternoon. Unlikely anyone will be forgetting his name in a hurry after this performance. Four goals in barely 15 minutes of play. Defino introduced as Laurent Blanc looked for a reaction. Boy, did he get one. Hit back within four minutes. Once again, Barcola finding Lacazette and Lacazette finding the net. Still, they had a mountain to climb with half an hour remaining, but they weren't afraid of the incline. It would be an unlikely source who'd set up a grandstand finish for the home fans who hadn't headed for the exit after Montpellier's fourth. Corner cleared, but another delivery finding the head of Dejan Lovren, who produced his first Lyon goal in the 70th minute. Back to the centre circle once more. Barkala thought he'd pulled off the unthinkable for Lyon only for the assistance flag to cut short his joy. However, moments later, he would return to type, bursting down the wing, heading for the byline and finding Lacazette who completed his hat-trick and his side's comeback. A hat-trick of assists for Barkala too. Just the second player to do so this season after Neymar. Lacazette's 23rd goal of the season to join Kylian Mbappe at the top of the scoring charts. 82 minutes on the clock. Surely no more. But there was to be one final twist in the tail. Lyon working their way into the box. The ball finding its way to the back post where Barkala was unable to add a winner to his three assists, curling just over. But Lacazette was appealing in the middle. 
The referee was called over to check his pitch side monitor. The VAR and after awarding Michel De Zakarian a yellow card for his protests, he would point to the spots. Little debate over the decision in the end. So now it was over to Lacazette. A 100th minute penalty to complete the most incredible turnaround. Captain Fantastic finishes off the job. 5-4 Lyon. Unbelievable. A crown, nothing short of what he deserves. Both teams see a player score four goals for just the second time in the French top flight since records began. The last coming in 1974.